What's up guys, welcome to another Destiny 2 video, and today is we'll be going over the number auto rifle from Future Roll Call, and basically just doing a legendary review over it. Before we get into that, please do subscribe to the channel and drop a like on the video. Let's actually look over the perks on this weapon, so we do know it's an Omelon weapon, as you can tell uh, from in the top left corner here, but let's look at the perks. So we have precision frame, this weapon's recoil pattern is more predictably vertical. Then you have the candle sight versus the flashlight. The flashlight gives us some more range and reduces handling speed, and I just feel like the candle sight is, it's okay. Uh, when it comes to scout rifles but with autos it just seems really um i don't know not not very stable and the recoil pattern is not as good as the flash sight and uh then you have extended mag versus ricochet rounds i go ricochet rounds for that increased range of stability um but maybe for pve definitely go with the extended mag and then you have high impact reserves uh which is this trait perk and rounds at the end of the magazine deal more damage so essentially it's glass half full from destiny one where half the mag does uh like a little more damage so essentially this is the same thing so for PvE I rated this thing a 7 out of 10 and the only reason being is because extended mag allows for more ammo in the mag to use against ads. I didn't really use extended mag uh, that much, I just wanted the ricochet rounds just to feel like how it felt for uh, Crucible but in any event with those high impact reserves you can do more DPS to ads versus uh, Uriel's Gifts trait which is tap to trigger and uh, it's the best archetype to have for auto rifles. It's the slowest rate of fire but it hits like a truck especially um, for like I guess like any PvE activities. I heard for the raid that this auto rifle is really really good uh in general like autos are just good in general in destiny 2 and i'm very happy considering autos in destiny 1 were trash and the only thing people used were palindromes and hawksaws and that's basically it uh, also with ricochet rounds you can make this weapon more consistent just because of stability increase also get a little boost of range to that as well for pvp slash crucible i rate this thing a 9 slash 10 out of 10 and this essentially uh this gun is the uriel skiff with slightly different stats and perks and everything like that that's why i rated a 9 slash 10 out of 10 just because it's not uriel's gift it doesn't have that tap to trigger um i guess trait and uh the stability i think is a little less on it but it's basically the same weapon essentially uh i think most people would run ricochet rounds for that increased range and stability i think this thing might come with a little more range than uriel's gift I'm not sure I'd have to check the stats. I'm actually going to be doing a comparison in another video. But um, to also have like that hard light effect with the ricochet rounds is good for hitting people around corners. Uh, basically when they're absolute and they have no shield and barely any health. Uh, I swear I've gotten smacked with this thing around corners a few times. I think I've only killed like one person with ricochet rounds. But it does help when you actually like can actually have um, like the, that perk to proc. Also, the rounds do more damage when the mag gets lower, aka high uh, impact reserves, and that'd be especially good for those, uh, I guess, like 1v2 or more engagements, um, especially, like, since, like, if you're not going to do as much DPS with Uriel's Gift, when it goes to the end of the magazine, you can actually, like, drop some people, like, if there's two people that cut out in the open and one has full shields and one doesn't, you can, like, take out the first guy with no shields, and then by the time you're in the magazine, taking out the other guy with full shield, you'll be doing, essentially, more damage to him. Uh, in the long run and this gun is definitely within like my top 10 weapons to use in the crucible and definitely within my like like top like top five weapons in general and definitely the top like top like two autos to use in the crucible like this gun and your girl's gift are essentially the same thing and the stats are a little different but if you don't have Uriel's gift and you have the number, definitely be happy with the number just because it's the same. You're not really missing out on Uriel's, to be honest. Like, if you have this, you are still good to go for the Crucible and I guess the meta that is the Crucible. All right, if you're looking for a community join, definitely hit me up. The link below, actually, so it'll say join the clan. Press on the link, request to join the clan, mess me on social media, which the links to that will be my YouTube and my Twitch description. And then all you have to do there is message me and say, hey, like, I request to join the clan, can you let me in? I'll go in and approve you, or an admin will go in, to, go in and approve you. Actually, I'm the... I'm the founder, but I guess I'm the admin for like Xbox, and then I have a guy for uh, the admin for PS4 letting people in. So that's really, really neat. Also, comment what you guys want to see below, and comment if uh, you think I can improve anything uh, during the videos and anything like that. It would make it more entertaining as well. I've, I've heard I'm very informative, but maybe not entertaining enough. So if you want to, to I guess, have me increase the entertainment, definitely let me know. But if you like these informative videos, I'll keep them short and sweet with no BS. And uh, that's how it'll be. Also, I'm doing a K6 figure giveaway. So if you go in the link below, it should be in all caps. All you have to do is tap on the link and essentially follow me on social media. And you'll be in the running for a K6 figure from GameStop. But anyway, guys, hope you enjoyed the video. We'll catch you next time.
30 seconds. Shut the enemy down. Well fought victory. One minute. 